Today I'm going to talk primarily about Working Papers functionality, but I will touch on CaseV very briefly in relation to multiple monitor usage as well. So let's get started. In Working Papers, there is an ability that allows users to take a window from inside Working Papers and drag it outside of the application workspace. First, we must dock the window that we'd like to move outside of Working Papers, and I'm going to use the Document Manager for this. First of all, I activate the Document Manager by clicking on it. Then from the Window menu, I select Docking View, which places the Document Manager in a dock frame. The dock frame has a thumbnail that I can grab with the mouse, which will allow me to move it to the top, bottom, left, or right of the screen. And here's the thumbnail across the top of the Document Manager now. Because I'm working on one monitor for this presentation, I'm going to set Working Papers application to the right side of my screen. Then, dragging the thumbnail of the dock window, Dragging the thumbnail of the docked window also allows me to drag the frame outside of the Working Papers application workspace, which would allow me to place it onto another screen. When I'm done with the extra window, I can drag it back into Working Papers window and undock it. Back into Working Papers, I'll just maximize that. With the Document Manager activated, go to Window and choose Docking View to remove the check mark uh, from the Docking View option. Case view also has functionality to have each case view document open in a separate instance. In case view, there is an option under Tools, Options, Interface that allows me to select desktop document windows, which will cause each case view document to open in a separate instance of case view allowing you to move each document independently of one another. If you want all case view documents to open in the same case view window, then I go back to Tools, Options, Interface, and uncheck it. So let me click OK here, and the two tabs that were there are now two separate case view documents, which then allows me to compare my items side by side. Now I've got a frame set there, let me just adjust that a little bit. And so here I've got a fixed asset schedule, and in my other document I have my notes to the financial statements. Both are in their own case view frame with all the functionality of case view, design, form mode, etc. for each of them. Now if I go back to the tools menu and select options, and on the interface tab remove the check mark for desktop document windows, it combines them back into a single frame and then I can minimize and maximize the windows as desired. 